What's going on everyone? This is Tone Dub. So it's in the evening time and a friend of mine called me up telling me that they got swarmed on a tree by the park over there. I've been there all day. So I got there about 8 o'clock so I don't have much time to work with. I found a swarm as he described it on a tree by the basketball court. I thought I got it on video before I shook it down onto the box. I guess not. Uh, it's a medium swarm. Not too bad. It's just clean on the bottom of the tree right there. Most of the bees I dealt with, you know, they're pretty calm. I can actually put my hand and touch them and, you know, you try to get a handful of them. That's why I thought I'm going to get some of them and put in the box without, you know, shaking the whole bees onto the box. But as soon as I touched the uh, bees, they stung me right away. That plan did not go as planned. It's getting late, so I decided to shake the bees into the box. But stupid me, I did not put on the hat with the net on it. As soon as, you know, I shook the bee down, I mean, they chased me down and stung me in the head by my ear and continued chasing me around. I think I have caught uh, some Africanized killer bee swarm. A lot of bees remain outside of the box. I said, hell with this. So I just wrapped up the tarp all around the box and tossed it in the car and drove it home and just tossed it out there in my backyard so the next day i wanted to move them into the uh, appropriate box so i found one spot right here so before i get a chance to uh, move them and they got me right on the ankle boy these are some mean bees so if they continue to act this way i might have to requeen them because you know i can't have like a uh, bee that you know, run around stinging people i'm gonna clean up this old box right here and uh leave whatever old frames in there let them deal with it because i don't want to mess with this hive because they're a little pissed off and don't want to get stung by them no more After I smoked them, uh, they seemed a little calmer. Uh, they didn't really bother me. I got my uh, bee suit on and I didn't want to take no chances. So um, let's hope they remain this way, you know, workable. You know, I don't want to put on a bee suit just to mess with them. All right, everything's all set up. Most of the bees are in the box and uh, I'm just gonna leave the other box next to it and let them find their way back up there. I'm not touching them. Well, here it is. Swarm number five captured on May 2nd, 2020. And this is the first swarm that I caught that required me to travel away from my house to get it. So live and learn. I mean, I bought, uh, I think I bought all the right equipment, but next time I'll do a little better. Having a pair of pruning shears will be helpful. This way if you have, you know, bees 
cling on to a branch, you can uh, clip it off and put it on top of your box and start shaking them onto it. I hope you enjoy this uh, video and if you do give me a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel please subscribe and I'll keep you posted on my next video. Thank you for watching.